What's good, everybody? It's your boy, Big Guns for Hire, bringing you another game of domination in a map com combine. And we're going to see what's popping, bro. This match right here, this gameplay was actually live commentary, though. And, dude, man, the freaking program that comes with Elgato have filled your brother up, man. It have filled me up. Felt it felt me and and when I'm trying to pull it out, it just it didn't record. Like it recorded, but it was all distorted and all messed up, man. It just didn't work out. And it's sad, man, because this live commentary was freaking epic, yo. It was like it was so entertaining and epic, man. For real, yo. I'm not trying to blow my my blow my horn, but for real, yo. It was it was it was it was it was, it was the it was the hit it was the shit, man. For real. But anyway, um, all in all, man, it was a good game. So I'm going to post it anyway. And uh, so you guys can see it. Look at this guy, man. He just destroyed me with a shotgun. So on my last on my last video, man, I gave some shout outs and and thanks to let me let me take care of this guy first, man, because he throwing that smoke. He think he's slick. I'm putting some distance between me and that guy, and look at that. I took care of him real quick. Headshot, even through the smoke. So, this gun, man, this gun is lovely, man. I love this weapon. Anyway, uh, I gave some shout outs to, to, uh, to, some, to some guys that have give, given me love. And I wanna give a shout out, a special, a special shout out to my boy, Bliss Obrasco. I'm gonna put the link in the description of his channel, man. Go to his channel, show him some love. Tell, tell him, you know that your boy, Big Guns for Hire, sent you there, and I uh, show him some love, man. He got some great content, just like the guys I told you last on my last video. All of these guys are on my future channel list. Um, you could check them out. You could subscribe to their channel, and uh, like I said, just tell, just tell him. Like, if you go to any of the channels on my future list. Um, most of these guys are are pretty new channels. Like they they small channels, just like mine. Um, they doing better than my channel, but they on and all they're small channels. And I'm gonna tell you something, guys. I do not. The only semi the the biggest channel in that future lead channel is Saken, uh, my ride channel, which he got about over thirty thousand subs. But uh, that's about it. And my, my reasoning behind that is that, dude, if you got 70, 80, 100, 200,000 subscribers, you don't need to be on my future channel. For what? What do you gain? I got only 33 subscribers. You feel me? You don't gain, you get no, you gain nothing from that. And, and just because I push you on my, on my future channel, I don't mean you're gonna show me any love. Because you're gonna see it the same way, I'm like you're not even gonna you're not even gonna acknowledge me, you know what I'm saying? Because for some, you know what I'm saying? You, you know, and I I understand. Let me tell you something. I'm not hating. I understand the game. Let's not be naive. You know, it, it, it you you know the reason behind people get on YouTube, they want to they like playing games. If they doing that or if they doing a, a comic comic stuff like they're doing uh comics uh, skits and stuff like that the comedians or whatnot if they want to get they want to be known they want to make money doing something they love to do and i get it I, I i get it and i respect that look at that that head glitch is not gonna help you son so just like me i know i like playing this i like playing games i want to make money doing this and that's why i'm on youtube you know what i'm saying because it's a venue that give me an opportunity to make some bread doing this. So I understand the game, you know, you're not gonna see here and show somebody like myself some love on your channel or, or, you know, by giving me a like on Twitter or mentioning me why I got 30 subscribers. You know, you got 70,000, 100,000 subscribers. Why do you, there's nothing for you to gain. You feel me? You know, you, you, you're not going to do it. It's like, it's, it, it, you got, 
you don't you don't lose anything but just the fact that you don't gain anything you know it's like do it's like a lawyer going out there and doing a pro bono work you know you know what I'm saying doing pro bono work pro, pro pro bono work in a in a in a divorce case you know what I'm saying he's not going to gain anything from that you know so um what happened here? I think this was the uh oh yeah that we, we started in the second half. And and doing this is theater mode, man, uh, and uh I'm tripping. Anyway, I started the, the second half with a care package, a UAV and uh and my team over here, man, my my hives. But uh, back to the conversation real quick. So it a lawyer that do pro bono, pro bono work for a divorce case unless is a known personality, they, they're not going to get nothing from it. You know what I'm saying? But 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 to a pat in the back of good work if they win the case. That's all they're going to get. You know what I'm saying? So you you have to be a person that like, that gets a, gets a, a drive from helping people. You feel me? That, 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 that drives you. That that's something that you like to do. Because if, if that's not the case, you know, you're not you're not gonna really do pro bono work like you don't know say like that. Now, if you're doing pro bono work on a serial killer, yeah, you get some. It's not really pro bono because you get publicity, and if you win the case, you're gonna get a lot of work. You feel me? So it's not really pro bono. You see. So the same goes with this thing here. Like say for instance, if if my brother were to be uh the marco j or if my brother were to be uh ali a like if he was like my real bro brother my brother you see what i'm saying and 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 people get a whiff of that like these commentators that that have 70 80 000, uh subscribers they be like they be all they be promoting my channel like crazy why because they're gonna want to do commentary a dual commentary with uh we Ali A because Ali A got you know so many subscribers or or or, or let's see anybody like if uh, anybody that had like a million over subscribers they'd be like oh sh you know what I'm saying oh let me get with this like like for example like I go further like say for instance if, if I still were to be my 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 uncle or something. You feel me? Like if I still was my uncle and and I'm sitting here I'm playing with I T. And 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 worse can about that old man that's uh big guns is ice tea nephew. People man, people be be like all in my on my junk, man, just because they're gonna they they, uh, they might have an opportunity to have ice tea in the in the channel doing something or, or sh give him a shout out or something and, and they're gonna blow up in in YouTube. You see what I'm saying? So I, I get the game. I pick the game. You know, they you know, if there's nothing for you to gain, why would you do do anything for 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 somebody like like myself? You know, unless unless we cool, you know what I'm saying? Like unless you know me or we friends or whatnot, you know what I'm saying? You want to blow up or something. You feel me? So okay, I get it, no problem, you know? And I respect it. So but uh I, I'm, I guess I'm telling you this because there's a lot of young kids that I'm on, on this thing and they want to and they want to get big and they wanna they want to be popular and they want to be they want to have some kind of fame they, they don't they want to be known and you see these kids they go into these big channels like I, I read the comment and they want to do do a commentary and they want they want these big commentators you know to, to get to show them love. And they got like 10 subscribers, 30 subscribers like myself. And they get disappointed, they get heartbreaking, and they go to the corner and they cry and they think that, why do you say that Ali A don't like me? Or why, or you know what I'm saying? Or And they take it, they take it too hard, you know what I'm saying? Because they're little kids. But I'm here to tell you, don't take it too hard, you know what I'm saying? This is a business. This is not... And in a world of business, if I don't have nothing to gain, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna help you. I'm not gonna do nothing for you unless there's something for me to gain. You feel me? Not many people are gonna sit there 
and help you out for nothing. You know, I get shot out from these uh, these guys that shot me out because they are good hearted people like Tactical Angel and and uh, um, uh, Blizzo Brasco and um, and uh, and uh, and Blow Ramson and that's Auto Man. Those guys have a heart to help me out and to support and we support each other like I, you know what i'm saying i do for them they do for me you feel me you know what i'm saying and and, and that's all good and then the i'm not saying that the other guys in my future channel are not good hearted people i'm not saying that are you saying that you know um you're not going to encounter too many people like that on youtube that are willing to do something for you you know for nothing just because they, 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 just because they want to do it, you know what I'm saying? Just because they want to be kind and, and they want to show you love, you know what I'm saying? You, that, that very rarely happens. So, you know, um, this game, look at that. Pay attention to what I'm talking about, man. We were losing really bad and we're about to make a comeback. This was a really close game. My, when it, when we started playing this game, you're going to have to rewind it. But when we started playing this game during the first half, we was getting a butt kick really hard. I'm talking about these guys had Timber, Tim, Timber, Timber, uh, Timberlake books on um, and kicking our butts. And forget that, Timberlake. They had construction boots on with a steel toe, and they were freaking kicking our butts with those. You know what I'm saying? That how hard it was kicking us bu that buzz with. And and and, 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 um, and for some reason with the second half, it's like my team put on the filler sweatsuits and with the band and the and the and the wristbands and the and the and the uh and the towel the 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 towel uh, uh socks and, and they just went sweaty on these guys like hard. I'm talking about they 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 took a personal, and now we get look at that. We took the, we getting ready to take the lead, man. We was gonna make a comeback in this one. I was very excited, man. This was this was this was a very epic commentary, for real. Now I'm explaining to you something. I don't have enough time on my next video. I'm explaining to you the reason behind me running care package and UAV only. Um. I just don't have enough time now, but anyway, guys, I really want to tell you that, talk to you about that, and I hope you understand what I'm saying. And for those people who you know who are um, who are making it and who are having success, do, please don't take offense. What I'm telling, don't get bought hurt. You know, um, I just being real and I just letting people know the reality of, of things that you know, no gain. No pain, no gain, pretty much, you know. So, anyway, the score, 25 and 8. Your boy went ham. Thank you for watching. Till next time, man. Peace and adios. Subscribe!